So today we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, it, when I used to have a channel a long time ago, we used to do a thing called chat time, and that's what we're going to do today anyway. Yes. So Max is going to talk about uh, new things in Lego, and I want to talk about stuff in sim racing. So it's a bit of both here, and also this will probably become a monthly feature. Depends on how well it goes. So, go on then, Max, take it away. Either monthly or bi-weekly, yeah. we don't know yet. Uh, so, for starters, uh, the, the uh, March Lego sets have just uh, been properly revealed. Uh, well, March Ninja Island Lego sets just been properly revealed today. Uh, yesterday, sorry. <laughs> On January 31st. So, uh, we're going to be, we're gonna be talking about them. Now there's probably going to be pictures showing up on one of the corners, we don't know which, that, that, maybe even down <laughs> there'll there. There'll be some pictures in one of the corners of the new Lego sets. Yes, yeah. so starting off the smallest one, Ryu the wrong Young Dragon, don't ask me why I'm saying that weird, I just am. Um, it, it will retail over here for £13, or £12.99, uh, in America it retails for £15.99, and uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool, um, actually full size build for the, for, for, you know, Ryu and stuff. It's pretty yeah, good. it's good, isn't it? Yeah, it is quite good. We're definitely going to be uh, picking that one up. Uh, next is uh, just a uh, Lloyd mech. It's just been shown. I've forgotten the name of it because it's kind of boring. Uh, but um, it, it is cool. It's just another one of, you know, the mechs of that series up there. Um, so, yeah. Uh, next set is a uh, four plus set. Um, we don't really care we about. We don't do four plus sets, do we? No, it, we might show it off just in case, but maybe, probably not. Though. Yeah. Uh, uh, next, we have uh, a set that uh, kind of annoys me. Uh, Aaron's buggy thing, whatever. Why it's does it annoy you? It's overpriced the whole heck. Right. Yeah, it is a it's a forty 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 four ninety nine over here. Yeah. For only two hundred and fifty something pieces. There's a lot, isn't it? Yes, that is a lot. Probably going to get it, but I need to wait. I'm going to wait for it to come down at Smith's. Yeah, so it reduced in price. A bit. Yes. Uh, next set is a uh, Kai's Ninja Climbing Mech. This is a nice, actually good big size mech for Kai. We haven't got one of them. This one you're getting? Yes, I am getting this one. Yeah, it is 623 pieces for over here, uh, 59.99. Yep. It's a pretty cool set. What I will say is the arms, the the top arms, both of them are different, and one of them is objectively worse than the other, so that's a bit... Oh. Neat. Our next set, this is another one I'm getting, the Shadow Dojo Temple thing, whatever it's It's a big set, that is. Yes, it is. It comes with eight minifigures, and they're pretty cool. Uh, they're pretty cool minifigures, and uh, yeah, it comes with Shadow Dojo and stuff like that. There's not really much more I can say about that, apart from it retails for... One hundred and forty, no, one hundred and nine, isn't it? One hundred and nine. No, one hundred and four ninety nine. One hundred and four ninety nine. And it comes with one hundred and oh god, one thousand one hundred ninety pieces. And the f final set, I think, yes, it's final set is um the. How? I know it's called. What's it called? Dragonstone. Dragonstone. Stone. Not temple. It's not no, it's temple. like a, it's just like a, a diorama type thing. Yeah, isn't it? it is. It looks really nice, but it's not my thing, so I'm not guessing it. Oh, have pictures there. Uh, same price as the last set, and it comes with twenty more pieces. So I think you can work that one out. Well, then the day these are released, we'll be picking these up, and we'll do probably a quick video before we start building them. Show you the boxes. Show you. Yeah. We've got them, and then we'll do videos on the reviews on them moving forward. Yeah. But yeah, on the day of the release, we'll probably show you them. Yes. So, I want to talk about sim racing. So, obviously, if you've watched my channel for a bit, you know I was into drones, and I'm into night sim racing. There will be drone videos coming back on the channel at some point, because I've now started flying again. But, um, at the minute, I'm still very much focused on sim racing. So, the two two or three things I want to talk about. First one is the GT2 pack for Assetto Corsa Competition. It came out. It's awesome. Just buy it. The cars are fantastic to drive. They're not as... If you drive... The GT3 cars can feel a bit robotic to drive. These don't. They have more of a feel to them. Hit, hit corners hard and everything like that. Good set. I think it's $14.99 for the pack. It gives you the six cars and one track, and the one track is Austria, 
which is an easy track. I find it a very easy track to drive on, but yeah, good fun. Get that. The other thing is, I said of course the two. There's loads of videos running about trailers coming out now on it. It looks phenomenal, and hopefully it'll be it'll bridge that gap because at the minute you've got GT3. I, I know you can get the. I know you've got. Um, I've got AC and I've got AC Content Manager, and you can download all the tracks. But some work, some don't. Some look a bit rubbish, and this is going to be a much better fix. Hopefully it'll come out very soon. I don't know when they're saying, hopefully spring. And the last thing I want to talk about is a new wheel. So they've got a new direct drive wheel that's come out with pedals. Now, this is the thing, it's made by Turtle Beach. Now, if you've ever had any Turtle Beach products, correct me in the, if I'm wrong in the comments, but they were garbage. Everyone I've tried and used, the garbage. The headsets are garbage, the controllers back in the day, they were terrible. It's coming out of 700 quid. It's got 500 new, 500, that's the wish, isn't it? Five new meters of torque on the wheel. If you see one, it looks like one of them little Fisher Price kid things you can get, which has a little screen and you can drive the car on the little screen. You had them when you were six or seven. That's what it looks like. It looks cheap, it looks plastic. I've not had one in my hands. It has a button box to the sat to the right hand side of it, and it also has a screen that shows you well, a bit like a DD screen. Now a DDU but I don't know I can't see this being any good there's not it's a bit vague all the stuff that's on it at the minute there'll be some videos coming on YouTube I won't be getting one and um, that's a certainty um, and that's the three things I really wanted to talk about at the minute they're the three biggest things at the minute to me that are coming forward uh, I've I dropped some quick videos of some GT2 footage on my channel last week um, if you've seen them one with an overhead helicopter broadcast and one with a tele broadcast and it's just easier for me to do them at the minute because I, I drive on triples and if you've ever tried to get triples down to one you end up with big bars at the top moving forward we will be having it it'll be on single screen because i'm going to use obs to do it so the center screen will just be on so that's what you're going to get so anything else you wanted to talk about mate? yes there is on, actually so so uh, we uh, just got leaks, they might not be true we don't know yet but we got leaks for the Lego Jago summer way yeah. Yes, I uh, just want to talk about some real quick. Obviously, we don't have pictures. Yeah. So uh, I'll just tell you. First one is uh, Zane's Mo Ice Cycle, whatever it is called. I I'm making that up. It's probably just called Zane's Bike because it's not an official name. Comes with apparently 73 pieces. That's small then. Uh, yeah. Is it an 899 set? It will be. Yeah, it's like an 899 set. Don't know how many figures it comes with. But it will definitely come with Zane, that's a certainty. Uh, next set is uh, quite a jump in pieces. It's uh, a weird dojo thing, like kind of like the one we just uh, got with yeah. getting, sorry, uh, with the March set. So it's just another dojo. Uh, don't ask me why there's two dojos in a row. Uh, next set is um, a weirdly overpriced uh, ninja combo vehicle. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very weird thing. It sounds exciting, but it's only 500 and something pieces, so I'm not sure what they can really do with that. No, yeah, I'm not there either. Uh, next step, this is really cool, a coal neck uh, uh, with 1,000 pieces. Ah, yeah, that sounds good, doesn't it? Yes, and it's probably going to be the size of just, uh, let me going to be the size of this, which is a pretty big set. Yeah, it's a big set. Yeah. Look at that was a really nice build as well. We'll have a review of this coming soon. Yeah. Maybe even next week. Also, about the um, Kaiser's climbing mech, we're not sure if it has knees or not. Nobody really knows. No, it's a bit strange the pictures we've seen, isn't it? Yeah, because it's not mostly showing knees, but it might be using knees. It we might don't be. know. So, uh, and then next set is probably the most exciting set a really big dragon. Yeah. Like 1,700 and something pieces big. If you've watched the videos that we put up of Max's Lego, uh, his collection, you'll see that dragons are a big feature. <laughs> dragons and mechs yes. are the biggest features. Which is why the, those are sets. Uh, and he's really them. looking forward to getting them in the summer. We'll be getting those in the summer as well. Obviously, if they're real, if they're not real. It's, it's, if they're real, yeah. Oh, one of the things I wanted to mention is, although it's nothing to do with what we're talking about today, one of the things that we're really looking forward to this year is the Switch 2 coming out. Oh, uh, yes. It's a bit... Jank is the stuff we've heard so far. No one's got any definite because it's Nintendo being Nintendo. All we know for definite, it's an eight-inch screen. 
it's not an OLED screen, we know that for certain, and we know because it's still got some kind of detachable controllers. Yes. Everything else is a bit up in the air. You we don't know when it's going to release, but we, we think it's going to be released some point early springtime. Yeah, because it's Feb, isn't it? The... Yeah, Feb, February to direct, so it's, so, and if it is released spring, it's probably going to be announced there. February. Yeah, so Which February is, is a Nintendo Direct, isn't it? it? Yes, it can be kind of weird because usually February Directs are actually quite small according to people, so quite interesting. I wonder what the console's actually going to look like. Is it just going to be a Switch with a bigger screen? Yeah, who knows? Who knows? Who well, knows? And one last thing before I go is, I uh, just wanted to say RIP to... Um, Gran Turismo Sport, which ended yesterday, so I don't know if you knew, if you watched the videos, it was the last time you could play online yesterday, they killed the franchise off, mm -hmm. and to me it was an important thing because it's what got me into sim racing, to be honest, it was a great buy, I think it was 15 quid when it came out, or 20 quid, so, and it was only supposed to be an interim filler till GT7, which then was a lot, lot later, but yeah, that's it, anything from you? Um... I don't think so, apart from the fact that there might be, uh, apart from the fact that I've got Lego City Space, uh, I never thought, uh, just because I never really thought I would never get Lego City. Could never review them too. Yeah, yeah. So we'll have a review coming up next week on a set, maybe, like, do you want to do your Lego City Space stuff? Yeah, sure. I mean, it, Max is very against Lego City, so yeah. getting Lego City Space is quite a big thing for him. Like, there's obviously some things I quite like, like these, these are quite cute, but most of the sets, I'm just like, they've yeah. definitely gotten better over the years. So we'll probably come with that video next week, because he's got three items, isn't there, in the space set you've got so far? Uh, no, I've got four sets. Four sets. Yes. So we'll have a review on those probably next week, we'll review all four at the same yeah. time, make a nice video. Or that. Yes, so, have a fantastic week and uh, yeah, see you uh, next week on see Thursday. you next Thursday. Bye. Bye.